will come to order. Once again, we led in prayer by our guest chaplain, Rabbi Arnold Restenkoff, retired United States Navy chaplain. Thank you, sir. Let us pray. O Lord, who gives to everything a season and a time for every purpose under heaven, a time for war, a time for peace, a time for life, a time for death, and always time for hope. We take time now as this week starts and as we pray the fighting, all fighting in Iraq nears its end to honor those who serve, who fight, who sacrifice in times of war so that the time of peace, of real peace, might be. We take time now to offer thanks for freedoms that are far from free, for they are bought and paid for at the cost of lives cut short and family dreams that now can never be, and at the cost of lives that will be touched and haunted by memories so painful that most of us give thanks that we will never know nor ever, ever fully comprehend. Lord, we honor those who gave their lives, and we honor those who still live and serve within a world that knows too well the time of war. And we honor in a special way their families, those they love and who love them, for whom the battlefields seem much more close to home. Give us the faith, the strength, the wisdom too, to do our part to bring about the time of peace for which they fought and fight, the time of peace for which we pray, the time of peace, just peace, in which we must keep faith, the world of peace, which we must do our part to build. And may we say, Amen.